Well, supporters of the rise against the Libyan government gathered today in Colombia to protest Muammar Gaddafi. Nearly 100 people rallied together, including Libyan Americans as well as passers-by. KOMU 8 Sam Karakin has the, their say on what you heard today. The message was loud and clear. Rally leaders like Osama El Taya stressed that you never know what can come of a small crowd. This may get other people up and, do, and doing the same thing we're doing and putting pressure on authority figures to come out and speak and putting pressure on other authorities. You know, you never know what the smallest thing. Now, at this point, most towns and cities in Libya are reported to be under the control of the people and not the government of Muammar al Gaddafi. Go! Must go. Even passers-by felt it right to join the crowd. People want freedom. People want democracy. People want choices. Dictators can't just, you know, take over for decades and do whatever they want. I guess they can and they have, but it's not right. El Tayash has a special name for those people who are fighting for freedom in his home country. All my heroes, man. They're, 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 they've done an amazing thing, amazing thing they're doing, and, and we can't do enough. We're, we feel helpless here. And this is part of the reason we're out here doing this. El Tayash remains hopeful. Victory will come soon for the fighters he's supporting. Free, free Libya! Free, free Libya! Sam Karatkin, KOMU 8 News, Columbia. And after the group rallied on campus, it marched to Columbia City Hall as well.